Assalamualaikum and hi. My name is Muhammad Aidil Firdaus bin Abdul Razak, DE180128. This is the our task for the assignment one, and this is was uh, the picture that we must name a uh, ten sample for this chatbot, and the device that I use, which is Oppo A57. With the rear camera was a 16 megapixel. So the software that I use, which is a MATLAB, at the MATLAB we go to the apps and we find the camera calibrator. It's right here. And we go to the open session because I have already made the task. So we find the file that I have saved. Uh, this one. At the left side, we see the picture that I have taken the 10 sample for this chatbot. And this is the picture for the green one to detect point and the yellow one for chatbot origin and the plus which is reprojected point. Okay, for, for the highest mean error in the pixel was a picture number 3 with the value was a 0 0.91 and the for mean error is 0 0.68 for the lowest one in the picture number 6 with the value was 0 0.41 this is the camera centric which is the camera in the center and where is the image was made for example for the picture number six we can see this one and the picture number three like this one and for the pattern centric is the where is the camera was located like this now at the this one distorts the image and how do we want to undistort this image so we got this to show the undistorted and the picture will came like this and we go try to the another picture with number three uh, this one this angle so this is a distorted one and we want to undistorted so we click here and it will become this so we try to the other one which is the random picture that i have take this is the distorted image and undistorted one is like this then we export the camera parameter And we save it as a camera params and we go to the workspace to find the value okay we can see the data that we get for the radial distortion which is 0 0.1058 and negative 0 0.4132 and for the tangential distortion I've got 0 and 0 and for the instant streak metric I've got 3.1469 exponential 0 3 for the focal length for fx and for the fy I got 3.1449 exponential 3 and for the image center for ox I've got 2.1110 exponential 3 and for the OY 1.5998 exponential 03 now we go to my others member thank you so hello my name is Mama Asfa Babila you can call me Mama Asfa so my metric number is DE108137 so let's look at what I want to do here is how to calibrate the picture. So basically, we use MATLAB for this assessment. 
So first thing first I do is put the picture inside this my lab. The picture that I want to change, which is understood this picture. So first thing first I do is uh just input the picture and convert it to JPEG. If it J if it JPEG, uh, it cannot detect our our system. Lah. So here you can see some error here. So the base the base uh the base picture is the base name picture is C. So the this so the picture is we convert it to JPEG. So what I do next is uh we used to have a calibration toolbox to extract the grid corner. So how to extract the grid corner is we pinch every single angle from the picture, which is which part we want to pinch. So we we do for 14 pictures to get the precise angle of this picture. So MATLAB can detect our picture position. So after this we can we can see our uh, results. So next is we calibrate the picture so we can get the result which is our focal length the principal point value the skew skew of the picture so you can see that no zero zero is zero then angle as well as 90 so distortion is uh the value is here you can see and the pixel error so next i will show you the uh, so so here, here is a, our phone, phone camera. Then this is the object. Actually, this is true because I take uh, this picture far from our object, which is our picture, simple picture, so number thirteen. So here, remember, we take for fourteen picture. So it's too crowded at the first at the in front of uh, our camera so this one is 13 14 and 10 so we can convert it okay this is the distance from our camera and the sample object here so our sample object is like uh, chest so 13 and 14 so you can see how far is it that i take this picture so you can see our angle here so I take from this, this side, and then this side, and then this side. So as this, this way, this show that where the angle that I take. So, so this is a sample project. Okay, next is how to uh, analyze error. So basically, this is uh, error, error distribution. You see our blue color, red color, and green color, and pink color this is the error distribution of the sample so next is undistorted image so undistorted image is actually to convert it, the real image to the undistorted image lah. so after you can see here is this is the result which is okay here so here is the real image and then this one is undistorted image so you can see our, actually our picture is already clear nothing to change but you can see after we using MATLAB to convert it it, it look like more fish eyes so, uh, the picture is bent right and left so you can see the result here. You can see the picture is more bent. Try hard to change, but nothing to change. See, uh, this one nice. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. 
My name is Muhammad Firdaus bin Ahmad Rofi and my metric number is DE180094. So for this assignment, the phone model that I use is Vivo V3 Max with 13 MP of camera. So I will continue with the simulation. So to start off the simulation, we need to open MATLAB. After that, we go we go to the application and then we scroll down and search for camera calibrator. We click that. After we have clicked that, this window will pop up. So uh, this is the I have done it. So the first thing do to do first is we need to add image from file. After we have done that, we need to calibrate the picture. Uh, after we have calibrated the picture, this will come out. One, two, three, four. Image camera centric. Reprojection errors pattern centric. So as we can see, number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That is the number of picture I have with my camera. So uh, in camera centric we can see how the picture is taken and in pattern centric we we can see how we take the picture so mean errors in pixel the overall mean va error value is 0.25 for the highest error in pixel is picture number 1 yes 0.58 error for the lowest one is 0.15 so after that we need to see the camera parameter so we press the right button uh, after we have pressed the right button this will uh, come out and then we can see a uh, radial distortion so the value of the radial distortion is 0.1150 and negative negative 0.2856 for the x correction and y correction and then we can see the tangential distortion is 0 0 after that uh, we go to the interest intrinsic matrix we click that and then so this is in the intrinsic matrix so the first one is is the fx which is the focal length expressed in pixel unit the value is 1.0022 exponent 03 for the next value is the fy a which is the focal length expressed in pixel unit the value is 1.0014 exponent 03 the next one uh, is the principal point also known as the image center value of OX this val the value is 6 for 3.8167 so the value for o y uh, is 465 
basically what we have done here is how to understand the picture so and then you can get the re the real result from uh my lab so you can get detail of the focal length how the disc distortion the skew number so next is you can see here my gopro so basically i learned how to and this start the visitor. Uh, actually GoPro have already this mode. So I took this picture from the same length as the same distance and same angle. So you can see this picture is this start picture. So look more wide. And this one is real picture. Eh, uh, this one is after this start and this start picture. That's it.